Roy Jones Jr. is the only boxer in the world with gold belts at middleweight, super middleweight, light heavyweight, and heavyweight. The athlete who has often been compared to Mike Tyson is famous for his irreproachable statistics. He held 74 fights, of which 65 he won, including 47 by knockouts, and lost only 9 fights. You are watching the channel This Is Interesting, and today we will show you top 5 of the hardest knockouts by Roy Jones. Number 5 Roy Jones Jr. vs. Glenn Kelly, February 2nd, 2002, Miami, Florida, USA. Okay, gentlemen, I won't lie. Clean the sports black contest. You both know the rules. On this point to end about, you both obey my command. I wish you both luck. Of the arsenal. That's it. Now, Jones came close to showing us. That's it. He never knew where Jones was going to punch from. Just jump with routine success against Glenn Kelly of Australia. And down goes Kelly on a body shot. Wicked body shot. Four, five, six, seven. Kelly's corner is free. Talent will not carry you there because of the style of the opponent or whatever. Same move, they learned that on Saturday night. Yeah. Again, once again, third knockdown of the night. Who never saw it. <laughs> you know, that's pretty amazing because between rounds, Alton Merkerson, Roy Jones' hand-picked trainer from Pensacola, asked him to go ahead and get the knockout and said, we've got somewhere else to go. Number 4. Roy Jones Jr. versus Richard Fraser. January 9th, 1999. Pensacola, Florida, USA. Because again, he doesn't give you anything to punch off. Left hook stunned Frazier. Little right hand tap knocked him down. And hello, Chris Green is not written on the bottom of Frazier's shoes. And that's the end. Armando Garcia decides that that's a good moment for stopping the fight. Well, this is an early stoppage state, as we saw in our last double header here a few weeks ago in those circumstances we questioned whether the fight should have been stopped in this circumstance number three roy jones jr versus virgin hill april 25th 1998 biloxi mississippi usa Number 2, Roy Jones Jr. versus Montel Griffin, August 7, 1997, Mashantucket, Connecticut, USA. Let me tell you, that first left hook hurt Griffin. And so does the second huge round for Roy Jones so far. And Roy Jones is playing the fainting game, and Griffin is benefiting by it. Whoa, what a left hook. What a left hook. Second Over knockdown of the round. Hook. That was a leaping left hook, and Griffin may not survive it. He's got trouble. Nine. And that's that. Uppercut. Yes, sir. Who's the man? Who's the man? Who's the man? Another look at the punch that finished it. He landed that flush, and you saw Montel trying desperately to get up, but he just couldn't get his leg. Jones gets his vindication via a first. <laughs> Number 1, Roy Jones Jr. versus Brian Brennan, October 4th, 1996, Madison Square Garden, New York, USA. And I think the punch that 
that started go, that go. was a left to the body. That started that whole Again, combination. We mentioned that Jones was so calm weathering that storm, blocking punches, just looking to set the other guy up. And you mentioned, Larry, that the, despite their power over that extended arc, every punch is being blocked by Roy Jones. And he lets the guy throw his punches, and he says, okay, now it's my turn. Thanks for watching. Like this video and subscribe to our channel.